Good evening, Luke. How are you this evening? I'd have a message. Get off your fucking phone! Yeah. Listen, how are you this evening, Luke? Drunk. What is your opinion on horoscopes? Some bullshit. What's your horoscope, Luke? Capricorn. And what does that mean? <laughs> if you could betray someone, how would you do it? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no sinister. What, right. If someone was to betray you, how would you get your revenge? Oh. <laughs> You would be mostly hurt in a variety of ways. Organ and organ and organ and organ taken just taken probably for sustenance purposes. Take a drink. Um, if you could be a shape, what shape would you be? I'm all about the echo. Echo, echo, echo. Not included. Echo, echo, echo. Ah, drink. <laughs> Parasitically. Oh. Hold that one in regard. Explain how cars work. So, car go broom, because carburetor and other vehicular stuff says go. So, when you meet people, how do you judge them? Do you judge them immediately or? Ah, shit, that was unpleasant. Huh? <laughs> so, we've got two uh, inebriated to continue and vomited everywhere. So, we'll do a bit more another day. Hi and welcome to Drunk Interviews with Luke. I'm Luke and this is Luke. Hello Luke. Hi Luke. What sci-fi film would you like to be in? <laughs> sci-fi universe or sci-fi film? Let's go film. I'm going to go with the universe. There is a video game that I quite like called Mass Effect. And if I was going to choose an alien that I quite like to be or to fancy, to be, I'd like to be a Krogan from the Mass Effect universe, and because uh, because they have redundant organs, so they have two kidneys. No, no, they have six kidneys. No, how many kidneys does a regular human have? It's two, isn't it? Yeah. So they have four kidneys, and interestingly, they have four testicles. So they're remarkably fertile. If you had to issue some commandments. What would they be? Do not kill. But I'm fine with hurting. Hurting's fine. Say someone got accidentally killed. How would you trial that? How, how would you move through that e equation? Ah, oh, damn. How'd that happen? You do it on purpose? Nah, not good. What would your next commandment be? Be nice. So be nice, hurt, and do, but do not kill. I follow you? Imagine you could think of a, a completely unique commandment. I think I'm going to go with, rather than be kind to be other, treat others as you would like to be treated. Which is fair, because then when someone fucks you over, you can fuck them over. It's a fair system, I think. Uh, imagine you were alone in a forest, miles and miles and miles away in the, I don't know, big Canadian forest or something, and all you had was a stick. How would you go about surviving? Oh, there's a fish there. 
Wait for my moment. Wait for my moment. <coughs> Got a fishy. Uh, if you were stuck in the middle of a desert uh, in, say, the Middle East, how would you proceed in that survival scenario? Am I of my current complexion? Yes. I'll die. I'm, I'm going to die. I, I'm going to get my head cut off. Let's be fair. I mean, I'm not going to survive that. So imagine you've been captured and you're going to be beheaded and they're recording it. You know, um, what was his name? Friggin' uh, Isis Sammy. I, I can't remember his name. The, the viral guy from Britain that was doing things. Imagine he was recording. What would you do, if anything, in that scenario? You're about to be beheaded. This is a, this is a bit of a shit way to go, really, but... Hey, what the fuck is this? You're, you're just executing yourself. What kind of fucking question is this? You're executing yourself. <laughs> I'd attack him. I'd attack my <laughs> person, but I mean, I'm still going to die. But I might as well maybe hurt them a little bit. It's not going to matter, though. I'm just going to my fucking head cut off on television. What the fucking questions are they? You asked for some... I'm done. I'm out. Well, that was an interview with Drunk Luke. Come back next time for someone else. I think I need to hire a therapist.